back at it again in another episode of Tame All Things on Quick Survival Girl for the Public Core Media Series. I do my in intros different <laughs> each time, By the way, not port. even the same. Yeah. Port. Yes. I'm not know. sure if you ever experienced this before, but when you go live, you don't actually go live until like maybe a few seconds after. So when you do hit live, that's why it's kind of smart to watch your stream because you don't know if you're actually recording yet. True. Um, when you're doing your opening, I don't, you weren't recording yet. It was still time to run. Wow, I feel stupid now. Yeah. All right, welcome yeah, back just to just another like, episode. <laughs> like a 10 seconds or whatever, yeah. yeah. Uh, I do know <laughs> Hello. It's, I'm going because I got two views, so. So yeah, welcome back to another episode. Apparently okay. I started the intro just before the um, stream started going. Um, I do stream the episodes. It's the only way I'm able to record at the moment because my capture card doesn't work with my new computer, so I have to use a streaming service and download the footage from there. So everything is in 30 minute segments. Sometimes they'll go over. And I edit the videos later. Hey, um, Port, go into the, um, mm -hmm. go into the Rex and see what we got from the Alpha Rex. Oh no, the Stego they had it. They know what we got. The Stego had it. Oh, the Stego had it? Yep, Stego got the killing blow. Um, so, what we had, there was an Alpha Rex trophy that's in the house in a chest so we can put in the museum later. What else we got is a Mastercraft pistol, journeyman pants, um, crossbow, hatchet, Rex bone, skin helmet, and then Alpha... Got two crossbows, by the way. I have one of them on me. Um, Alpha Tyrannosaur. Um, two. Playing, two of uh, Arc Survival Evolved. Oh, Alpha and some recipes down below. Decorative coloring, apparently. Mm hmm So yeah, that's what we got. Well, this other stuff is just, oh, well, we got this stuff up here is what I put in the creature myself. Also, the apparently the Sego has collected Allosaurus brains from killing the Allos that attacked as well. Another 30 minutes. Yep. Yeah, sure, and then I have to go back to the desk to you. The last of it. Alright, well, just so, check out that I saw a red jump for a second there. Ah, oh, yep, I did see a red jump. Not that many players on, so I might as well grab a red drop. See Wait, where are you going? going? How There's a red jump. I just want to grab it real quick. Oh, red drop. Okay. okay. Yeah. We don't get them often, because usually there's that player going around on it. Either Wait, trying there, to you actually want to do the Destiny 2 stuff? <laughs> but you said you weren't dealing with the grind. I mean, yeah, it got. It, it, I'm not sure. Does Solstice ever get um, pushback? Ex uh, uh, extended, I mean? Look, they said they were extending the Moments of Triumphs, and I'm assuming that means Solstice as well, because it's part of the Moments of Triumphs, so. Well, there's a pack of Allos. That's just great. I'm gonna leave them away. After they kill the Yank Hilo. Wait, was Solstice supposed to end the official day of the Triumph? So, instead of. Uh. I think it's supposed to it was supposed to end okay, the twenty seventh well, like everything else. Well yeah, it still it still says the twenty the twenty seventh for the triumphs as well, but that's probably still gonna be switched. Yeah. We just haven't done it yet. So hopefully the solstice will be extended to seventeenth of September. I think that's when Shadow Keep was supposed to come out. Yeah. They said that'll extend everything to the seventeenth. But yeah, I'll, I'll help you out. I have my I'm finally got my rare armor today, so Come and get me. I've been working on my rare armor. Come and get me. I just realized, Twinkie, if you actually do the Solstice of Heroes, you could probably, um... Yes, he'll your get max level. level. Really high, I think. Yeah. Well, for the army, No, he'll be he above the max level if he actually finishes it. Wow, look at that. A canteen. A canteen! Mind if I have it? <laughs> yeah, you can have it. I got another mob saddle out of that. Man, the purple drops. Well, yeah, Barry, I'll help you out. Ah, that's good, that's a... Lag. All right, back to building. I realize I, I want to start push. working on the second floor, kind of, because I can't exactly work on this. I'll floor gather resources if you keep Jesus. making the structures you need. Um, you want that canteen, don't you? Yes, I do. Sorry, filled with water too. Awesome. Thank right, you. I'm gonna I'm gonna go cut down trees and gather stone. You know what? Next
week's episode, we're taming a beaver. That's it's already decided. <laughs> we still need to finish taming all the um, redwood creatures. Uh, other dinos. Yeah, redwood. Yeah, there's still what the Archaeopteryx and the Microraptor, and maybe even uh, Trudons as well. Yeah, Trudons are really hard to do though. You have to actually t um, feed them tamed creatures. Yeah, I know. So honestly, one of the ways people got around that is that they took a pars, they tamed a pars, knocked, then they knocked out their own pars, leaving it on neutral, of course, and they stood on top of it while the Microraptor attacked, tried to attack them, but they're hitting the pars, and it kills it, and it does a huge amount of taming. That was probably the easiest way. <laughs> oh, wait, that's... Hey, Port, do you actually have your chat open? No, I don't. Oh, okay, yeah, you probably won't see what that just said. He pretty much told you to leave Gandalf alone. <laughs> I wouldn't do that to Gandalf. <laughs> there, my chat is on now. I, I, don't, <laughs> I don't think I did it right, but okay. Oh, I see it, yeah, I see the chat. That more aloes. We. You see anything in it yet? Yeah, I see, he says yeah. Leave, um, leave Gandalf alone. Caps. And after that? Sure. That's it. That's all I see. Absolutely. You see it? I don't even cross my mind. Um, but that was. Right. Yes, I can't do this one yet. I don't think I got it. Mostly do the fact that I can't do really this. What I'll do is I'll do this. But, um, Duck, relating to the Sources of Heroes, I can definitely give you some advice and help you out um, from getting your green armor set done and tell you what to do for your... Or I can help you out at the same time because I'm working on the blue set with my Titan. There's some easy methods to help get things done. Just look over the stuff you have to do, and if you see you can do a whole bunch of things in one location or destination in the game, you definitely want to do that all in one go, instead of Indeed. jumping around all over the place. Like the farming on Titan um, that I did with the Warlock with Koo yesterday, we got like five or six things done. So, it makes it easier. Right, I need a wall here, and I need a wall. And I'm only I'm yeah. I'm only going to legendary with my other two characters. My I have to do the Shadow Throne though this week with the Hunter to get the last masterwork. Are right, you working all the items? What? Oh yeah. Are yeah, you gonna master all the items? Yeah, I'm masterworking all the hunter armor. I'm not doing it for my other characters. It's too much work. Cause I would have to do Shadow Throne with my other two characters and I'm not mm. that good at And uh, doing a 200k Nightfall that I'm not good with those characters. Which, by the way, I can help y'all with with a 200k because I have a setting so that you can do it. Alright, what structures do you need? I'll start making them. Um, hold on. Alright. You look so tiny down there. Hello, little yes. man. <laughs> Did everyone just do I said walls speed? before. Oh, walls. How many walls? I'm doing the walls now. Oh. Not really a whole uh, bunch. We need, if anything, we need ceilings. Make a bunch of ceilings. Alright. I can't even see how many I can make, but I'm just gonna just make that. 100. I can probably make more. One more ceilings? No, just get one of you. Yeah. Alright. Any other structures that I could possibly make at the moment? Um, windows. Alright. Not, not the frames, but like the windows to go here. And then more walls to go above the windows. Okay. You mean windows to go into the frames? Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna count how many windows there are and then I can do the exact number. 
And then you want me to put a wall above those and then do oh, more window no, no, no. frames. Mm hmm. Alright. Go up to the second floor. Wow, Here we go. I just need to see them to touch this, which will work. That boom. Yes. Now we just need a bunch of ceilings. So I'm just gonna make a bunch of ceilings so you make the walls. Okay. Actually, no. Give me the ceilings. Maybe uh, give me the ceilings. I got fifty. Five. That's fine. Oh, that's fine. I realize it's right. so far. There's a certain direction I need to go. Where are the windows? I'll just close these up real quick. I'll make about forty of these. I mean, what the hell make... just happened? I'm gonna have to gather more resources again. <laughs> I'm just, uh, I'm gonna watch you. Are you kidding me? It wasn't even there. Something break. Oh, well, the skies with the red. Or orange, I should say. It's the end of the world as we knew it. <laughs> Be kind of cool. Oh, so you know, I learned something interesting about Arc Lore. Um, so, relating to um, our characters themselves, I didn't know about this, and I found out after listening to a video. So, our characters, you know how we, you know, respawn and stuff? Mm-hmm. So, we are the exact same people. See, when your character dies, their body is cloned, and your consciousness is put into a cloned body of itself. It's a resurrection yeah, no. mechanic in the game. It was created by Helena, one of the, um, survivors who, um, ascended. Yep. Story's lore. She created the resurrection system. And she said when Earth is reclaimed, or being, I think, reclaimed or um, risen from, or, you know, something about cleanse being from the corrupted element, the resurrection system would be gone, though. So we wouldn't be able to re resurrect anymore. That's interesting. So people are theorizing that. Or how that will change um, Genesis. Yeah, people are theorizing. Yeah, people are theorizing with Genesis, so if Earth is reclaimed, then it might be like a hardcore mode version. Where you have one life to live. As a mechanic in the game. And that's probably p people think probably pretty dope. it's better to go into. Like, you can play it like normal arc, but if you do it through this, like a story base mode where you have a character that's gone and done all the max ascensions and everything from all the maps and DLCs people believe that you know you have that maxed that max out you know um, implant so they think okay when you have that you're in the hardcore mode and you gotta do it like without dying or something It'd be kind of interesting yeah in my opinion but that or it'll just be an option to put in the game for a story mechanic permadeath mode that would be pretty cool yeah I wonder how many no, nice guys one. But what would be kind of like terrible is that imagine if you're like an official player and you're doing it and they have it as it's only permadeath and then you lose your character forever and you have to start all over. That would suck. I think that should be a mode that people should be optional to yeah. play. Not really. Be forced. 
Of course, dude. Like, so you want a window being above exactly where the yeah. other ones were? Yep. This is what I need to know. I need to know. Ah, this. cat. My sister's cat's trying to lay on my hands. Excuse me, Nala. I move over here. You're in the wiggity wiggity way. Oh my god, what did I just make a quad to make that thing? Oh, so close, so close. Actually, I just start from right here. Instead of trying to wait. I won't be able oh, to we got a lot of progression going on this one. Uh, easy Yeah, we do. Yeah, I want to be able to. In that case, let me just delete that. Let's start from back here. No, I'll go. If I start from back here, that's gonna look stupid. If I go up here. Oh, actually, that will look pretty cool. Care if I have one underneath. Uh, oh, I made one extra. Whatever. All right, I'm gonna have to gather more materials. I'll let finish placing though. Um, what I do have. Yeah, now it doesn't matter if it's underneath because no one can see it. Here yeah, they can. Eh, they kinda can. Now I need to go. Not too obvious. What, what do I need? Stone. Wow, just stone. Alright, that's easy. If the doe dig had a saddle. Oh, yes. Let's pick that up. Now I have an even better idea. Oh, you're getting so excited on the design of this uh, museum. Yes, I am. I love making this. It's gonna be your grand structure. Thank you, Ali, for letting me get rid of her home so I can do this. Breaking that. Hello, little Ovis. Oh, that did it. I did it. Okay. Alright, that should be enough done for now. How far can this go? Oh, I can go pretty freaking far. Why can I go pretty far? Why is it going so far? Wow. What that is, is great. <laughs> oh, that won't go far. Um, probably because the pillars, maybe? I don't know. Oh, good. I, I don't know why it went so far. Even if it did, it does not matter. might not match, but it could also get done. Alright, let me think. I need about... We're about to find out now, aren't we? Welcome back. It's been 20 hours. What 20 hours? I did not know they were one the time. By the way, when's the next challenge coming out for the next game? You can tell. Oh. Tomorrow. One awesome sauce! 
did it again. I'm not watching now, I'm not sure. <laughs> I know what's more. It's a funny show. Um, how I <gasps> Oh my gosh, it does go that far! And I know a lot of people... A lot of people don't hear it, but... The legit Chunky's in our party, so... I'm about to move your novel, like, out of the freaking... Yeah, you can move it. Easy. Move that bird. Plus it, plus it, plus it. <laughs> ah, Chucky playing Fortnite. Oh my gosh, I keep making the same mistake. I'm just... There's like no way for me to actually go into the museum without going all over here. And also there's no stairs. <laughs> I think I still have some ceiling. Oh, the sirens me. are out. And I made the mistake again. I hear sirens for some weird reason. Dang it! I won't be able to place stairs here. Why is that? It won't let me. It's I think because of the structure. It's too high. That's just weird. Yeah, which we'll probably do. This has been thing. trapped in this spot for like a couple of days. Better than said. Oh, do that. I could just put these stairs. I don't know whether oh. me hearing this. I don't know if me hearing these sirens is a bad thing. <laughs> you hear sirens in the background, D-Gamer? Yeah, it's outside, yeah. What could it be? What could it be? Cops? Definitely not a tornado warning. Oh, that guy's No, sirens. not those kind of sirens. By the way, no, 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 What are you doing? What are you, what are you doing? You said place! I never told you. I never told you to make window frames. That's the one thing I told you not to do, actually. <laughs> I said, said I, windows, not the window I, frames. I asked you, did you want uh, more windows? Well, I, all I heard was walls. I, hold, I just heard walls. I wasn't really listening. But that's the but if the one thing I told you was not to do window frames. I don't do window frames. <laughs> uh, well, I asked specifically, did you want uh, window frames? No, I don't want yes. window frames because there's no... There's no reason for that to happen if, this, if the rooftop is going to go up there. There's no way to actually open the windows and close them, so that, that was a stupid idea. It's not a stupid idea. It is absolutely horrible. We have another problem. What? I don't know what to do for the ceilings. Or for the stairs, or whatever. The stairs are going to be incredibly hard for me to do. Because it stops here. It's hovering off the ground. Uh, Unless. Those are technically ramps. You could have just. Um, oh, that could work. If you put a pillar underneath that. I was going to do that. Two different ways. Or you could have put a pillar underneath and just had it going straight down. I can do that. Let me just see how this looks. Yeah, I'll keep going. I need to put one more there. I like this one a lot better. Alright, put railings right here. Yeah, can you do that? Hold on. Oh, I can't put... I was gonna do an aesthetic. Oh yeah, I don't think we actually put railings unless it's the railing um, foundations first and then the railings. <laughs> Gotta make it, man. Yeah, 
Hey, his controller just died. Alright, did I get it? No, one more. Oh, that sunlight is bright. Hey, Jen. Alright, I gotta make a whole bunch of walls. Long time no see. It's been a long time. I missed you. Oh, three days too long. Has it really been that long since you talked to Jen? <laughs> I just. What do you? I just realized. Why do you need his Pokemon Go? Right. Anyway, did you watch that new Pokemon trailer? I posted. The new one to the- no, 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 Sun and Moon, bruh, no, Sword and Shield, my guy. Sword and Shield! <laughs> the one that came out today. <laughs> Sword and Shield. Yeah, they only released one new Pokemon, and the new team as well. But, um... No, there's- there's- Aw, oh, dang there's it. There's technically two new Pokemon. No, there's two new, brand new Pokemon. One of them is a new version, is an evolution of, a, of an old version of Pokemon. And then two of the other Pokemon, or three of the other Pokemon, are actually old or new versions. Kind of like the Elobin forms, but it's called uh, Galorian forms or something like that. Yeah, the other, yeah, one's a Weezing, which is a Poison Fairy. Yeah. There's the other one, Zigzagoon. Zigzagoon and Lineoon have got the other two forms. Zigzagoon looks pretty badass, and Lineoon also looks pretty badass, I'm not gonna lie. But then they got an evolution form called Gigazoon or something like that. Or Galgazoon? Yeah, that, or, that, or Galgaloon or something oh, like that. Oh my goodness. That's the new evolution, which I don't think Lineoon is getting. I think it's only for the uh, the Galorian form. Because in, in the lore, it says that the reason why it got an evolution is because of the... Um, it's called, oh, it's, it's called Obstagoon, I'm sorry. Um, the reason why it got its evolution is because of some weird thing that the Galo region has, where it kind of adapted and evolved from nice. there. So I think... The linings in the Hoenn region. Yeah, yeah like a little Pokemon, how they change form and stuff. However, none of the... However, they're just all different forms of actual Pokemon that already existed. This is the this is the first Pokemon, I think, to have a different form and then an evolution on top of that. That the original one doesn't have. Which is the other right. thing. The new team is called Team Yell. <laughs> team Yell. Yes. Yes, Team Yell. And the reason why it's called Team Yell I, is because of the uh, their fans. Which, I, honestly, I think this is pretty interesting. It's not like that whole entire world domination thing anymore. It's their, their fans of one of your rivals, which is like some kind of like girl or whatever. She's like, I think I'm a pop star as well. But they're like hardcore fans and she's taking, she's taking on the uh, championship. And so you have to like base against her obviously but like her the new pokemon team they're trying to stop people from uh participating in gym battles and stuff just so she can become the best champion ever so that's why they're a problem yeah so i, I kind of like that because it's different from the you know world Easy domination teams that we're normally used to let's see how further i can go oh i can't go that Yeah, you want right, to see Oh, uh, we just need walls and window frames. I'm just making the window frames real quick. I got here. Here's some window frames. And let me grab a bit more material. Uh oh. Now we just need walls. Yeah, those are the new Pokemon that, and the new... Oh, you also get a third rifle, apparently. This third rifle's called BD or something like that. Uh, I don't really know. BD. B-E-D-E. -E. Or Betty or something like that. Oh, wait, I could've gone around. Whatever. And he is a Pokemon... He's pretty much a badass Pokemon trainer. 
He's not really Gary Oak, he's more like Silver. Silver. You know, you, you know who I'm talking about, right? right? I, I guess you could be like Paul as well. Someone's here. On a wyvern. Where? Down below. In our river. Oh yeah. Oh, he's coming he's right there. I think he's gathering clay. He's a wingsuit. Yep, you Excuse can... me, sir. Sir. Hello. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, that's the end of this episode. I hope everyone enjoyed. We got a lot of progress done in the museum, and we'll have more progress to show you next time. So see you in the next episode.